We can choose to be defined by our weakness, to be conquered by it, or we can choose to be motivated by it to humbly seek the Master's guidance and grace, His enabling power. This, then, is the potential virtue of weakness. If, by our choice, weakness moves us to humble ourselves before the Savior and to exercise our faith in Him, then by His Atonement we can become strong. So let's not excuse ourselves in the least point because of our sins or weakness. Rather, let us, like Joseph, choose to recognize our weakness, humble ourselves before the Lord, and exercise our faith in Him through thoughtful study of the Scriptures, heartfelt prayer, and willing obedience to the Lord. The better we get at consistently living in this manner, the more we shall, out of weakness, be made strong.